And good evening, everybody. Welcome to Squad Ops. My name is the Muff Bandit, and I'm going to be following all these fine gentlemen for this One Life event. We're here on the map of Sumari, nice little valley town in the middle of a crater. Got a little river running through it. And we are having the U.S. pitted against the insurgents today. The operation we're going to be running is Operation Neighborhood Watch. And it's the USA against the insurgents. I want to run over all our command and stuff real quick while they're getting kitted. Everyone's just joining in, so we're going to have a lot of comms, a lot of talking going on, a lot of organizing. But I can fill you in, answer your questions, do all that good stuff in the meantime. So we'll start with... The U.S., who I'm going to be following probably both rounds, just so that we can hear hear, hear uh, both sides as they play it. It's interesting what, following the attack team and hearing their strategies. Because the U.S. are attacking the insurgents, who get to choose one of four locations, which are Bravo 2, keypad 3, Bravo 3, keypad 6. What else do we got? Charlie 2, keypad 3 up here and of course delta three keypad four all right i'm kitted out and ready to go oops so the insurgents get to pick any one of those keypads and they defend it they, they're going to drop a fob at live they're going to have a logi truck running so that they can build a couple of dishkas and a couple of mortars and let it rain on the u.s who have got to push in and basically destroy their fob and wipe everybody out or be wiped out themselves Now. Not a whole lot of rules, but the big one is that vehicles must cross bridges. So the vehicles have got to use one of the bridges or none. It, it depends where where they find the insurgents, who I don't know where the insurgents are yet. We'll run over and check them shortly. Uh, that's the big one. Vehicles have to use bridges. No mobility restrictions for the infantry, so they can go stroking right across the river. It's only knee deep or something, but it's really really bad mud that if the vehicle's too heavy it'll sink in you know and get it stuck and they'll lose it but the light human can foot across it no problem and we've actually got a little bit of brief in here expedit is command and and let's let's listen to his briefing market these are the possible fob locations or the locations the keypads in which they can place the fob I'm going to mark them with the uh, green fob markers. Make sure I get it right. Key one, two, three. And D three, four. So those are the general locations in which they can set up their fob. <clears throat> uh, of course, they can build defenses around that and place their mortars and or discus if they choose. Uh, they have a logi, which they'll run supplies back and forth, and that's all they get as far as assets, so they don't get any other vehicles. Uh, the general plan is put, uh, Squad 1 is going to head out. They're going to go uh, north to check the location just north of police station, and if they don't get in, any contact, they're going to either swing south or hold there. The rest of the platoon is going to push down the southern MSR towards Raisin Dryers, and then we're going to hold just west of Raisin Dryers. And uh, well, one squad or a fire team will go out and scout the possible fob location up to the northeast there. More likely, if they're on this side of the river, we're going to get contact early. So that gives us a good idea that they're on this side. We'll adjust accordingly. We get two times the uh, open Humvees. Uh, squad 4 will be running those fix. Uh, the Humvees are mostly going to be for fire support. So they're going to be behind the platoon when we move down. Uh, the platoon's uh, walking the roads. Uh, you guys will be needing to do a little route clearance. Oh, uh, check for mines in the roof and uh, check for those IEDs. So the Raider class also does their nades work, but they can't see them, so that, that's also a potential threat to the vehicles. Uh, <clears throat> so everybody's kind of played this map before. You know the general uh, kind of fatal funnels that are here. Uh, just get good dispersion, 
good security, watch those corners. If we do have to breach and clear a compound, you know, squad leaders send the smallest element possible to go in there, buddy teams or a fire team. We don't want, you know, three or four guys uh, going through a door and then getting mowed down, either by a grenade or AR on the other side. Uh, that's the general plan. So squad one's going north, the rest of the platoon's going south. Uh, if we get contact, we'll adjust the plan accordingly. So just listen to your squad leads and fire team leads. Uh, the chain of command's going to be, if I go down, it'll be squad one, two, three, and then uh, uh, my fire team lead, which is tear gun. So that's all I got. Any questions? Do we have a rally point if uh, command goes tits up? Yeah, so if, if the entire command goes up and you guys haven't heard word of where the fob is, that means that it's probably not where we're at. So you guys will need to continue pushing towards one of those locations and hunting for it. <clears throat> so if the entire platoon or command gets destroyed within the first five minutes, I would check north police, south police, and then either go north through Ancient or south through the river. Don't use the bridges if possible and scout the one uh, east of Palace or south of training camp. And if you don't see it there, then cross over into the northern one. Um, that's the general plan. Just remember the vehicles use the bridges. If you sure you do not, so uh, we will not be using the bridges if we don't if we don't have to, because obviously they're a nice little funnel for death. So firm. The only other suggestion I have is if we do have to breach compounds, that uh, you guys mark your terrain features, and that would include murder holes, windows, doorways, anything that they can fire through to come back at you. So if we're crossing the river, obviously you guys are going to be watching those other holes and or suppressing those possible locations where they're going to pop out of and try to get you. So just mark mark your uh, mark your targets or mark your your possible uh, positions where the enemy is going to hit you from. So if you're being asked to suppress, obviously suppress those those obvious places where they're going to be. That's all I got, guys. So let's, uh, let's break it out. I'll let the other side know we're ready. Join the command squad, Saki. All right. Well, you guys just heard what the U.S. plan on doing. I didn't. I was repositioning over here above the insurgents who are kind of finishing up their briefing they've still got some guys trickling in but for the most part they're going to be defending this area delta three keypad four so the farthest east point they can a lot of little buildings and stuff around here a lot of little ditches and valleys and small walls there's fields to the south trees there's good potential here good potential for a good defense and kirkley is command for for these guys for the insurgents his squad leaders, no particular order being given, are uh, Hamleet, OD Tap, and Server Error 404. I think that's it. Yep, Command's got the rest of the guys in his own squad. He's uh, He's got them lined up. I can't hear anything they're saying because I am on the U.S. That's why they're red to me. But they might be starting to break out now. Starting to break out. Uh, yeah, Twisted Sigma, this is live right now. No delay. My mind right by police station. Do you think or, you know, just like the three-second delay or whatever. That's default. Um, that's going to be... It, depend, it really depends. It depends on how... Uh, if you think you can do it, go for it. The thing is, if they, if they decide to like, go as a platoon... Uh, I've seen it on, the, on, a, on this map before. Where they oh, wow. Boys and live at 125. Go. We are going live right now. Before where they have... Uh, so I've got Shattered Ritual leading his squad out the east of the compound that the U.S. started. Right, the U.S. started main. They get two Humvees. They get two open hop top Humvees. They're going to be buzzing around with those. Not sure what the plan is with them. The rest of them have turned to the south. We've got Best Pony leading well, maybe one full squad to the far south. And the other squad leader is Google Tricks. For the um, for the U.S., x -Bits commanding. Google Tricks, Best Pony, and Shattered Ritual are the squad leaders. So Google Trucks is in the back of his squad. Best Pony is the I tip of the spear. The, the U.S. are moving south. It looks like for the most part they're following beaten paths, roadways, buildings near them. All right, I have no visual. That is the U.S. command. Uh, all the way up to the bridge, so. 
We still need to All right, so it looks like one squad, Shadow Ritual squad, is headed straight for the Bravo 2 keypad 3 location. Maybe Bravo 3 keypad 6. They might be responsible for checking both. And they're both on the west side of the river, which is much more dangerous for the insurgents. But it could pay off being on the west side. Mainly, when this squad comes to look for you, you can kill them all. And then there's a whole squad gone. The enemy might know where you are, but the rest of them are way down there. So there's not all negatives to starting on the western side of the river. In the meantime, I'm going to throw a mark up right there. That is where the insurgents are within that compound or that keypad. And that doesn't mean they're staying there. That just means that's where their fob is and anything they're going to have sh everything set up within that radius. And who knows where they, they'll put the rest of their squads. Looking to the east, you can see they're spread out everywhere. There's a squad all the way to the north. So they're doing plenty of work. Shadowed Ritual has broken his team, or his squad, out into a couple fire teams. One going north, one going south. Giving out more orders. They're slowly clearing buildings. Uh, we're not taking any contact so far as we move through to a uh, police station. I'm going to try and get to police station hard enough and uh, try and get eyes on uh, high ground. Alpha, uh, you got All right, so Shadowed Ritual is going to head to sure police station, talk. or try to, and then get some eyes on whatever he may. Meantime, Southern Push going as planned. Best ponies Copy prone, that. crawling through a field. I'm, I'm advancing through the vines, crawling. Hey. They're almost if to the raisin dryers. Fire, uh, if you see them, engage. fucking call it out and shoot them. Not even going in. They're not too worried about it. Fire. They'd most likely have taken contact somewhere or seen the enemy if they were on the, one of these western locations. We've got the Humvees way in the back. Yeah, I can hear them way back there. Yeah, they're they're just chilling. No rush. They don't want to get taken out early. They can be very supportive. Later on, especially when the numbers get lower, uh, throughout the throughout the combat and just the the infantry fighting, one or two lat gunners will definitely be dropped. And as you can see, way south, they keep pushing. They can walk right across the water. No mobility restrictions for the infantry. Vehicles must use bridges. That's why they're waiting. And that's why there is probably this squad watching the bridge. And actually, Google Trucks just called out no movement by the bridge. This is a bridge of death right here, if nobody knows. It's dangerous. And we'll see. We'll see if they bring it. Looks like both Humvees want to come this way. Squad spotted a vehicle Bravo 2 keypad 6. Uh, kind of on that end of the road right there. So. Which from? Where from? South or north? There's a good little view from oh, server error. He's a. Oh, sorry, wrong, wrong. Obviously a scout role. No, he's a squad leader for, for Kirkley. He's an insurgent squad leader. He's covered both bridges. Somewhere around there. Is it close uh, to the go ahead and hold mortar fire for right now until we get uh, confirmed. Oh, yeah. You guys know about that bridge. Do you say key 3 or key 6? <laughs> I play vanilla, and I'm afraid to cross that bridge. But I feel obligated to cross the bridge. That's what squad ops will do to you. You'll, you'll think that you have to use no the bridges when you don't really have to. No contact as we move into slums. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. What must be a building, and I can see forces running around <laughs> in a dish gun. Which, All right, it sounds like Best Pony kind of is like calling like, out the I fob location. He sees a squad leader standing on a roof back there. The disco over there. 100% confirmed Delta 3. Okay, it's Delta 3. And they just said 100% confirmed Delta 3, or? keypad 4. Delta 3. Uh, two, go ahead and start moving a little closer. 3Ds, 3Ds. X-Bit's given Best Pony squad the order to go ahead and move closer. Uh, north of the river. I see Shadow Ritual Squad way to the north. The insurgents yeah, just to, uh, spread ancient, out everywhere. Neither one of these southern bridges is safe. You want me to go ahead and bound my bridge here? Crossing under the yeah. 
copy that three, whatever. Squ you need squads to all the way north. Them. They've got a full squad covering the bridges. The only thing they're lacking is in the south where Best Pony Squad is moving along. So good job by Xbit spreading his guys out too. Hopefully, once the fighting starts, everyone will be able to group back up together and have a little bit better chance for both teams because it's great to see full on warfare, big groups going at it, and grenades flying, and sometimes bodies flying. So it's great. Shadowed Ritual and his entire squad are still. Look at that, using the utmost concern for their fellow members' lives. They're crossing the river one at a time, getting in place, calling out ready, calling out move. Oh, and there's gunfire. Gunfire to the south, southern bridge. Pokesmont and Magellan have got across. Google Trex is on the bridge. He's going to... He's getting risky. North. I don't think anyone's gone down yet. Hips and Nips and Dermoplast are there for the insurgents. Miami Dade SWAT is very close to the east. Magellan just laying down the saw fire, suppressing everything he can. Everybody else is getting across. See the little names moving? Oh, I'm going to back it up. Zoom us in a little here. Hips and Nips goes down. Looks like Pokesmock got him. Throwing a nade over the wall. He's already down, but it's good effort here. Making sure of it. All right, boys. In the, north, in the meantime, the insurgents south. have they've stayed stone cold solid for now. To, uh, no, uh, but we heard the mortars. Not only from a scout, it seems like, and uh, the um, one of the raiders. Copy that. We'll see where these mortars come down. Oh, those mortars were way off, way too far north. I don't know what they're shooting at. But in the meantime, Google Trucks got his entire squad across this bridge with zero casualties. That's amazing. Just shows you how one game can be completely different from another one. During squad ops, the Humvee is across. One Humvee's across, two Humvees are across. You know, they're not, I don't know if they're looking very hard for anti tank mines. Those guys have scouts and, and, um, IEDs, so. Enemy oh, look at that. Google Trex, this guy's clearing them out. I see Magellan go goes down, but Miami Dade SWAT is also down. Server error 404 is the squad leader, and he is now down. Great grenade by somebody from the U.S. Good initial push by the, by the U.S. forces here. In the meantime, Best Pony squad is straight up prone, except for Best Pony himself. They are crawling along the wall, getting just, just slow and easy. Staying spread apart. That's great. And now they got a Humvee behind them making tons of noise. So maybe it's all for naught. There they are. They're standing up. They're getting close. Visibility is better while crawling. You don't yep. move as fast, but. Oh, Tear Gun. Tear Gun's asking him to move forward two meters. Looks like he sees something. Let's see if we see him shoot at anything. These mortars are landing on our heads. I'm going to keep trying to move my guys east. The buildings east of Kanat. The, the buildings north of Alpha. The buildings east of the All right. Looks like Shadow Rituals guys are getting into more action up north here. Perhaps being sandwiched. Hey, firm. Alpha will hold. Yeah, copy. Make sure they don't cross that footbridge. They haven't fired any Not more mortars. Quite, but they're staying spread out. They're doing a good job. These guys are on their toes. They're everywhere, looking everywhere. You can see, I can see, I can see the local comms going on. Somebody's reporting something to southeast. Not sure what it is. Jay Remick is getting hit by the Dishka fire. They were totally getting suppressed. I don't know how they're still alive. Here comes the Humvee. Oh, here we go. Oh, someone goes down. Jay Remick goes down. Let's see if this Humvee's pulling right into the line of fire. All right, squad three, three. Freddy, uh, move through this southeast. Bombardian goes down to the Humvee. Tear gun, lighting it up, shooting through the wall. He knows those things, those bullets pierce. Oh, I think he just went down. 
Tear gun just got, got dropped by something. One tapped. Zachy doesn't even know it yet. Yeah, he figured it out. He's backing up. In the meantime, best pony. Got his, his whole squad over here. Oh, there's they're, they're seen. Looks like a uh, monkey bullet goes down. There's Jackal Purcell, Hamley, Raider, and Kirkley. Kirkley's command. So they're getting close to it. Marking five pound pound with red. Oh, Hamley takes out Best Pony. Best Pony did get his smoke grenade off. He wanted to mark the the fob lo or the fob building, and he, he got it out. So nice shot by Hamley peeking in there. Oh, what a nade! I don't know who threw that, but Stray Dog and Gang Grill are both down. I think it was Fig. Fig's getting dirty. Where's he at in here? Oh yeah, he's got three down so far. That's good work by him. Nobody left. Oh, there is. Fulcrum. He's backing up. He's straight back pedaling. See you later, he says. I copy this squad one. Looks like you're the only viable uh, team left to do any work with. Copy that. We're trying to move east. Oh, down, there are so the many. Side of them. So many people just died in here. Did they get taken out by a mortar? Uh, oh, my gosh. Just, I don't know. Everyone is just, the oh, U.S. are spread out and they're hurting. Let's look at the total kills here. 8 to 18. Oh, yeah, insurgents doing work. Yeah, that's that's funny. The U.S. pushed in, killed about three or four early on, and it's been all insurgents after this. Zaki is he's taking shots with it. He ain't done yet. That thing's getting hit, though. I think it's just a, an AR, though, shooting at it. Oh, there's the dish get hit. Oh, there, command X bit himself getting in, moving that thing out. He knows they're getting hit. See where they're going. A lot of red arrows up there in front. I'm surprised they don't see any of them yet. But you never know how far away they are. Let's go take a look from their angle. Oh god, there's Fig right there. There's the Dishka that he's shooting with. Suppressing the hell out of the world over there. Trying to cut the mountain down. Sober Pud staying out of the Dishka. He's using his AR. He's got that bipod down. That thing's surgical from that from any distance. When you got that bipod. Jacko Purcell sh shot a shot a mortar. Let's see where it goes. He's looking. He's looking the direction. Oh, that was, that was close. Little bit far. Let's see if they move the right. Oh. Yep, a little far. A little far. Let's see if they move the Humvee. Small adjustments. They could really do some work. Still 18 to 8. No, Shadow Ritual squad up north is just doing awesome. They have been by themselves the whole time. There was some guys up north. I don't know where they are now, if they fell back or what. He's got him Let's broken out into two uh, separate fire teams. The, the lodge is going to be driving down. He's only lost one guy so far. But well, saloon number 12 and Wookie MT are down there lurking. And I believe on the far right, Ronald Reagan is in the lodgy truck. I think he's waiting for clearance. I don't know. Maybe they know something. Maybe saloon number 12 saw... Shadowed Rituals guys way up north crossing through the fields. I don't know. Here comes Big Yes from the west. Pushed on X bit. They, the the, the Humvee gunner, gunner just got taken out. So the silver man jumped into the gunner's seat. What? There are three insurgents flanking right now. A little fire team of three. They're pretty spread out. 
Shadowed Ritual just called out they're going to ambush the technical as it comes back, the Logi truck for the insurgents. Logi's disabled. All right, Shadow's taking it out. They yeah. got it. We disabled the Logi. All right, this killed the driver at least. Location before they know where we are. Oh, those mortars are getting closer. They've just barely missed both sides of the Humvee. I am Swan. Hmm. Admin cam doesn't work. Let's see. You might have to get with Barton. Oh, you're already talking to him. Oh, there's another mortar. That was close. Let's see if they sent any more. Fulcrum went prone. He got a little scared. I think he was already bandaged. Hamlet's pushed up with Fig up next to the Dishka. The insurgents are getting a little more confident. They've got a, looks like a flank squad coming from the southeast now. Hopefully that Humvee doesn't see them. He might be able to take a couple down in that wide open field if he catches them running across. Okay. It's so misty and hazy in the air, though. Oh, yeah, they're over there. Copy, copy. Oh, ho, ho, there's a mortar close. All right, we're covering some action northeast on Google Tricks. Oh, there we go. Saloon number 12 taking it to, to Google Trex's squad. He took out two of them? Three of them. That's oh, too bad we missed this. He is by himself in this little hut of things. Peeking around the building. Sure, he's got to stay a little bit mobile. Oh, he's getting in. He's going to come out and walk right out. Oh, right on More Eats Kids right there. Crawling. Oh, poor More Eats Kids. Good job, Saloon number 12. Just took out a fire team. Hammered Hebrews up in school. We got a lot of shots down here. Uh, move southwest across the school. Try and come to the south side of school. We're coming up behind him. Mortar's still hitting the ground. They're just not too effective currently. We have audible on the uh, mortars. Got Shadowed Ritual We're and Slinger flinging, flanking from the yeah, far that. east. Got a lot of work to do. There's a lot of insurgents left. I see Jack. I can see Jackal Purcell still there. Oh, there. There we go. Humvee hit by the mortars finally. Good job. Jackal Purcell got it zoned in. Oh, here comes another one, maybe? Oh, that's doing damage for sure. I can hear Fulcrum and Zaki saying, D abandon the Humvee, it's done. It's burning up. Let's see if he shoots some more mortars. He's only limited. I think he's limited now. I don't know if they're going to try and push and get the. Try and get that Logi truck back. The insurgents got a lot of Logi truck runs in. But it takes supplies to keep that mortar running, too. The Humvee's fire went out. Oh, what's he got? Does he got eyes on him? No. Nope, he doesn't at all. I'm just firing randomly. They're distracted mainly um, for Shadowed Ritual up here. Uh, I heard mortar fire. Let's see. Let's see if they can come down and take this Humvee out right here. Oh, nope. He redi redirected a little bit. But Zaki and Fulcrum took cover in the building as soon as those mortars started coming in. 
They took off. There's a couple more. Not quite going to get close enough. Shadowed Ritual and Slinger are slowly creeping in. Just... Eyes on. Eyes on. Many steps. An expert goes down. Command gets taken out. Looks like Hamley got him in the dishka. All right, we're gonna crawl. Hamley's west. doing we're a great job too. Southwest along this field. You see him take, take a couple guys down. He's got four taken out. Good job. Copy. Yeah, I think he uh, he's shooting. Uh, Excellent okay. defense hey, by the insurgents hey. there. Man's They're holding their man. positions. They knew where they were supposed to be and what they were doing. And right now, Shadowed Ritual is still waiting for orders. But he just lost his command. He's got the binox out. He's looking. Nothing but walls, really. He can hear the dishka, though. He hears it all. We are at 26 kills to 12. Insurgents are routing the U.S. currently. Both Humvees are down. Go, go, go. Watch, yeah, yeah, watch your west, northwest. It's okay. real quiet on the comms now. What do we do now? We got a fire. Got Mad again. Flavor, Fulcrum, and the Silverman off I to the west to side. The oh, they water. still do. They do still have that one Humvee. I got, all, I got audio on the cloud. But it's yeah, copy. I have the, rough shape. I have, I have audible on it too. In the meantime, on the east, Shadowed Ritual and Slinger are pushing. Okay, Slinger's down, though. Looks like Odie Tap just took him from the murder hole to the north. And Shadowed Ritual is down. Hamley just came inside, dropped his fifth guy, Look, I think. Sixth guy. Great work by Hamley, turning around, getting his ass in there. He just got married at the end of April, too. Congratulations, Hamley. We're down to three, and then there were three U.S. guys. We got insurgents all over the place. Let's see if they can even get across the river. What's that thunder run? Now they're across the river. They just got in the vehicles and drove really fast through the city. And you know, but they one of us could just sacrifice themselves. They're just kind of chattering right now. They're not sure what to do. They're the last three. I mean, you know, we have a driver, we have a gunner, and we just call out. Someone else to rip the gunner when they get shot. Yeah. They're talking about having yeah, a yeah, sacrificial yeah. lamb run out and take the shots while the other two move, or getting in the Humvee and just bombing it in there. I think they're just gonna go. I think they're just gonna go in the Humvee. Oh yeah. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. I hope they do. Go out with a bang. I was with command. So we can. Well, shit. We gotta do something. Let's just do okay. the death run you thing. See that field in front of us? Is the dishka watching that field in front of us? Basically, yeah. Probably. Which is in our area. They've so got two two guys, two insurgents that are 30 meters away, just to the southwest. All right, why don't you take 20? Now, I don't think they can hear each other at all walking. Well, More mortars getting yeah. shot. The U.S. hurt every time they hear that mortar fire. They're on their toes, saying, "Let's hide." They probably have eyes on us. But Big Yes and Mad to the Jack are clearing, clearing the compound just to the south. Yeah, that's a pretty, pretty close mortar fire there. Silverman saying, "Get in the field." Mad Flavor's taking cover. Fulcrum. Watching the corners. All right, we're just gonna go Let's check their six. Big yes and mad to the jack. Slowly pushing through. If they keep moving, they might get away. Big yes is slowly. He's just slowly creeping around to the south end of that Currently looking little south complex the there. Field. Here comes the mortar fire. It's to their west. So the three U.S. guys seem to be fairly safe out of mortar fire. Hamleach just letting it rain. They got shells to spare. All right, so everybody to the south, killed over to the west, killed over to the west. Here comes more. I guess we just gotta take it nice and slow. 
Let's check there. Yeah, big yes and mad at the jack. Just fine. They're sitting back. No hurries. No worries. Oh, Silverman goes down. Beautiful mortar. That was crazy. Fulcrum is bleeding. Mad Flavor has shit his pants. And it is looking grim for the U.S. God, I shit my pants just sitting here watching it. it scared the hell out of me. <laughs> Fulcrum has confirmed that they are, their location is known. That was a beautiful mortar. I did not expect that at all. Are you crawling or are you walking? Hammered Hebrew is up to the northwest. He's on top of a building. I wonder if you can see him or not. If they peek up, he's going to be looking right at him, though. He's up there with his binox. He's got the binox out. Yeah, he's scouting for him. He's totally he's scouting for the insurgents. That's how they know where they're at. He's been watching them crawl along the whole time. Oh, it was an IED, huh? Oh, yeah, it was. That's a huge boom. If I'm going to die, I'm going to die running towards the bullets. We'll get back on hammered Hebrew. Look at those eyes. Those eyes have seen some shit. All right, we got to find this. Oh, God. Bad flavors. It's all Fulcrum. It's Fulcrum. Hamley is hes freaking seeing red, man. Oh, Fulcrum takes out the freaking unkillable Hamley and then gets taken out himself. It is amazing. Round one is over. That's an insurgent victory. And well played by them at that. Some, some good mortar fire we saw. Uh, for the most part, not effective, but it did take out one Humvee. And then an IED for the ages at the end there. Seven kills by Hamley. Great job. You know, Fig. Fig had three in the beginning. He had that awesome nade in the beginning, too. That was a good job. Mad to the Jack had seven. He must have been the one on the west side helping out Big Yes up there. They put in a lot of work. You know, props to Shadowed Ritual Squad going north. Taking that out. Google Trex pushed across the bridge with his squad. Xbit, awesome job commanding. Kirkley, awesome job commanding. And that was only round one. They're going to switch sides. We're going to listen to Kirkley command his squad next time as the U.S. pushing in. And this will be round two of Operation Neighborhood Watch, a one-life event that is from the squad ops community. We'll see a couple highlights uh, during the break. We'll take a five, ten-minute break, go to the bathroom, do all that stuff, get another drink, and we'll show you some cool stuff. Uh, maybe even some of our SOTT videos. So we'll be right back. See you guys in a few. Thank you.